guys, it's Jason. I'm back in another episode. Today, I'll be showing you guys how to make your own custom intro or download a template and you can change your name on it or whatever you want to do. So, a good website to do this on. Um, also, I'll be telling you guys how to do um, Panzoid files or PZ files and put it onto YouTube. So, if you go to panzoid.com, it's a free website. You can do whatever you want on it. So, if you want to download your own custom template that people already have and just put your name on it and then upload it to YouTube, you have to click community templates. Um, you pick whatever one you would like. So I'm just gonna pick this one. For an example. All right. So once you get to the thing, you want to go to this little button that has the um eyeball on it, and once you click that, this would make you actually see what they see. Actual C. So if I click Spot, this will look like. Alright, so that's the intro. And so if you want to change your name, all you gotta do is click this little box thing right here. And you go to the text group. And you change the name. So mine would be Jesus. And usually you should just change both. So, and you had to click enter for some reason. I don't know why. But once you do that and load it up again, it should have your name. I might look weird just because I messed it up, but. Alright, so that's what it looks like, and if you want to change the colors, you could just go to, if you just scroll down, to whatever, right here, the color, it's custom right here, but some might not, and so you can change the name of everything, if you want to, so, yeah, that's how you do that, but, right now, if I go to this, and start a new project, I want to be showing you guys how to make your own. So, it's kind of difficult. I don't know exactly everything and how to do it. But, I would start off by making a text. And, you could bound. And I'm just going to mess around, for example. You could scroll out like this. Go to this little um, camera right here. Use colons. So, and then do that so it like zooms in and then you should like move it somewhere so then it'll be really slow so if I do this click that right there but if you want to add effects you go to the thing right above the camera add effect I like using all B G all G B shift and I like using racial radical blow so now it looks like this. So once you do that, you could add group somewhere. One hundred, and then scoot it over a little bit. So now, if I go back, do this should do that so that's like pretty much how you do the intro you could add more effects or whatever you really want but if you want to download this all you gotta do is go to my heel to actually put it onto youtube you gotta start the video end all and after the video end all is over it you download it and then it should be able to put on youtube so i want to show you guys after all this is done rendering so yeah hey okay, guys the video is pretty much not the video but the intro is pretty much done rendering so once you're done rendering it all you gotta do is download it and then so you click here download the video so once you get to this it should be like save bio as blah blah it should just pop up. You don't. You shouldn't be have to click whatever. So once you do that, 
you go to YouTube. <laughs> So, once you go onto YouTube, hold on, I guess, we'll sign. Hey guys, once you get to YouTube, you gotta go to click this upload thing. And right here, there should be a thing that will say, um, you can just upload your video. Alright, so it says select files to um, upload. I'm just put this on private so you guys don't see it because that's not my intro I'm gonna be using. I have it on my own. So you click this, you open it. So yeah. So Alright guys, so once you upload the video into it, you could drag it in front of all your videos like that. So then, your intro will be in it right in the beginning of all your videos. So, that's how you guys do it. See you guys in the next one.